Hey, what's up? My name is Dairo. I'm here today in LA in the East West Studios. I'm going to show you some tricks working with bass frequencies and harmonics on my razor blade. So check it out. I set up a basic um, relation between sub and kick drum and I sidechain it through a volume automation that is like set up right here. I'm gonna show you a cool trick how you can add harmonics on top of this. Um, so basically what I'm trying to show you is you can take um, harmonics out of any sample, any kick drum, any bass line, you can basically steal the harmonics from it. Within Edison you can open it up and you can basically select one waveform. If you add that waveform into Citrus, let me set it up default here. Let's go to one oscillator. If you drag that one waveform to the oscillator, it will copy the harmonics. So this still has bass frequencies. So the first harmonic, you can take those out because we're already uh, using those within the, the first Citrus. Um, that's playing the bass line. Let me pitch this down so you can hear it. We basically took the bass harmonics from this kick drum. This is exactly the same. I got it already set up right here. So let me just show you how it sounds like with and without. So first, this is how it, the sub sounds solo. And this is how it sounds like with the um, harmonics on top. And if we turn the side chain back on and play it all together with the kick drum, it will sound like this. Let me turn the harmonics off again so you can hear it. So in regards to sidechain, I just want to show you how I um, tackle sidechain in my, in my songs. So basically what I do is I have a volume control on anything that I want to sidechain. And I have two separate ones. I have one for the, the bass lines and one for anything on top. So if you see right here, this is for the bass lines. It has a real slow um, sidechain because the kick drum is always playing. And then the rest has like a, a faster um, decay on it. So let me give you an example with the bass line as well. Um, if you have a volume control and you link everything to that envelope, you have complete freedom with where you want to put it and how you want to put it, and you can actually see how your volume is um, decaying over, over time. So this is really helpful for me and it gives me a lot more control than using um, like grow speed or, or any other um, sidechain plugin techniques. So this is what it will sound like all together. So this is how I use harmonics in my song. Um, I hope you learned something today and uh, thanks for watching.